hello friends and welcome to another video in this video we are going to see how to delete older snapshot but exclude some vm so the script will not delete the snapshot on that vm uh, this is our uh, simple script where we have created the credential uh, variable to enter the credential to connect to the vcenter then again uh, we are using vcenter as a variable so uh, we'll get the option to enter the vcenter name uh, here we are connecting to the vcenter uh, with the help of vcenter and the credential variable now again here we have a, a days old variable like i want to delete older than three days so i just have to enter the three days count three count over there if i want to delete a snapshot older than five days so i just have to put five and uh, it will take that ca uh, days count and it will start uh, checking the snapshot older than uh, the what the count we have put there then uh, we have the very much uh, important variable here that is vm to ignore and here we have to specify the virtual machine's name in the text file for which we have to uh, ignore the snapshot so here again we are running the git hyphen vm for each object command so what it will do basically is like it will scan all the virtual machine on the vcenter and it will check if that virtual machine name is present in that vm to ignore variable and if it is there then it will not perform any action but if it is not there then it will definitely uh, perform the action what we have specified that is delete the snapshot so here we are using the git hyphen snapshot so here we are collecting the information about that snapshot uh, like the name uh, or the description or the size or when it was created correct so that was the main impo uh, important information we want and then in the next line uh, we are actually deleting that snapshot so currently i have uh, made it as a comment because i just want to see how the result i get uh, whether i'm getting the accurate result or not and according to that i can just enable this command and it will uh, delete the snapshot on the virtual machine okay so uh, let me show you the vcenter here so i have a three vm where the snapshot is running okay and uh, the snapshot was taken on you can see on 13 uh, december 13 december and the 16 like the today uh, i had taken one more snapshot so uh let me run the script and uh, i'll show you how uh, it detects the snapshot okay it is asking me to enter the credential to connect to the vcenter is now connecting to the vcenter and then we have to enter the days count how many days older snapshot we have to delete so uh, currently i have a i guess three days older snapshot and the current snapshot so uh, i'll put two days older snapshot i want to delete so i'll put a two count here and hit enter and it have given me a uh, two two snapshot from each vm why it is so because uh, I want to delete a uh, two days older snapshot and uh, two days older only two snapshot is there because it was taking on the same date. You can see here 13 December, 13 December. Okay. Uh, suppose I want uh, to delete everything. So I just have to put uh, zero count. So it will start calculating from today onwards. So let me run the ending part because I'm already connected to the vCenter. So I don't have to again run the credential and vCenter that variable. So I'll uh, here. Sorry, I'll run from here because I need to enter the days count and enter the days count zero. I want to delete the latest as well. Okay. Now you can see it have given me three uh, result because it is showing the current date snapshot as well here for all the virtual machine. Okay, so how to delete and how to skip that. So now currently you can see here, it is giving me a uh, result for all the three virtual machine, uh, CL2, CL1, and CL3. Now I'm going to ignore one virtual machine here, so it should not show me the result. So let's skip the last one, C1. 
cl03 ok save now uh, let me run the final part again and uh, let me put the two days here now it should give me the result for two computer ok uh, mom cl03 01 and 02 how it is giving me the result ok let me okay sorry I entered the wrong name here that is the reason it is giving me the all three computer the correct name is mom hyphen cl03 that is what my VM name is okay so let me run the part again two days and now you can see mom cl3 server found in ignore list so it is not showing me any reason but uh, there is nothing to worry you can check directly uh, I'm giving here because I wanted to show you that but here you can just write uh, the comment and no action here so you can just do like this and there will be no action in this uh, category and it will not show you anything okay but uh, to show you I'm giving this right host and which host is added in the ignore list so it will show that okay and it will only show if that uh, virtual machine have the snapshot if that virtual machine do not have the snapshot definitely it will not get the snapshot content okay so uh, let me add the next machine in the ignore list now I'm adding the second computer here and uh, let me again run the script Run. now this time it should only show me one computer and you can see here it only showed me the one uh, CL1 result and uh, uh, it didn't show me anything else okay you can see here mom CL2 server found uh, in the ignore list and uh, mom server 03 found in the ignore list so it is giving me that information and it is showing only the result for CL01 now how to delete the snapshot right so we can just enable this command here okay now what it will do whatever the result it is showing me it will only delete the snapshot on that virtual machine so as of now uh, CL02 and G uh, 03 is added in the ignore list so it will not delete the snapshot on that virtual machine but it will delete the snapshot on the uh, 01 so let me again run the script and it will really uh, delete the snapshot on that two days older and you can see remove snapshot command is running and it is running on the 01 virtual machine you can see here now it will delete the snapshot and in the recent task you can see remove snapshot cl01 cl01 and it is only deleting the snapshot that is older than two days so today's snapshot it will not delete so we are safe on that part and we can verify that after the snapshot uh, removal task is completed and you can see here only one snapshot left and that too we had taken today so it is not deleted that snapshot because we had given the criteria that only delete the two days older snapshot so which snapshot was taken uh, before two days that is only it is deleting okay so this is how you can use the script so let me again uh, remove one computer from here so it will delete the snapshot from that too let's keep only one virtual machine okay so let me run the final part and delete the two days snapshot so here in CL02 it is deleting the snapshot and only keeping the two days snapshot fine okay CL03 is added in the ignore list now if I run the snapshot deletion script and I if I hit uh, enter here 0 it will delete today's snapshot from both the machine okay from uh, this 1 and 2 you can see now the all the snapshot has been deleted because I entered 0 over there so from today onwards it started deleting the snapshot so in this way you can uh, create your own ignore list you can add your own VM that you want to keep the snapshot and 
you can use the script for your environment and uh, you can let me know if you have any doubt or query i'll try to answer that thank you for watching the video